Well, Tristan, pretty big shot there, pretty big moment. Take us through that sequence, what you saw, what led you to that shot. Um, well, before that, I smoked the first free throw, the one and one, so I'm like, that's bad. And then we get a stop, so I get the rebound, and then coach is talking about this. Well, we ran a play to give me a ball screen downhill, with, so we could just get the last shot. And I just try to give us a chance. You were pretty determined to take it a little like, I mean, they had two or three guys on you. Is that just one of those moments you feel like you, you kind of want to take that shot? Uh, yeah, I mean, I kind of lost the ball at the end. So I just, I really just wanted to, well, because after the game, I heard he was wide open. So I was like, <laughs> I would have passed by and see, I just wanted to get a shot up. I didn't know how much time was left when I shot it. So I was just trying to get a chance for it to go in and win that. Huge night for you um, on the scoreboard. Were you just feeling it the first half? Offense seemed to be flowing through. You guys were kind of starting to you know, uh, almost search for you on the court. Yeah, I feel like uh, I was just cutting well. My teammates was finding me, running the floor and stuff. My teammates was finding me in the open floor. First half, you guys started out 0-4 from the floor. Second half, started out 0-5. How did you guys not let that get you down and have a pretty good shooting run? I don't know if you're it was pretty good night. Well, we work on shooting every day, so everybody's confident that they can make shots. We're confident our teammates make shots, so. You just have to get over it. You gotta have a short memory with basketball. So we just keep shooting and they'll start falling. Brandon, did you know early on that um, you know you were able gonna be able to score like that as you did, you know, especially in that first half? Uh yeah, kinda. But eh, it was like I ain't really focused on scoring, so if it just comes to me, they just come and one of the, today was one of the big. Six days off, did you guys feel more refreshed as opposed to last week playing three and four days? Yeah, I feel, yeah, we got a couple of days off, so we were well rested. So yeah, from three games and four days was, I haven't done that in a minute, like since high school at AU, so it was different, but we got some rest and we're pretty good. You glad that happened, so come conference tournament time, you ready for it? Yes, sir. We'll be ready. A lot of really good energy from some guys, and then you know, Felton, three offensive rebounds, Brandon Johnson, 19 rebounds total. Talk about the effort, you know, on the glass and those gritty plays that kind of really, really matter. In a, Two point win. Yeah, those are our, those really are energy guys for real. Like especially BJ and RJ, both of them. Like how special. Like when RJ that one possession, he grabbed. I think he grabbed like three offensive rebounds in one possession. And BJ, he always been like that. He does that in practice, so it was really nothing new for us seeing that from BJ. The rebound it sounds like coaches really kind of hit on that a lot this early this season. I, you know, Spurs y'all rebound the ball really well, and then other Spurs maybe it's not there. What, what do you guys think maybe is the the key to that as far as consistency going forward? Uh, really, just energy. We just all need to chip in, box out. Like I know sometimes I'll be sitting around the top of the key after they shoot it, watching, and I need to go in there and help. So we always got a team rebound, and I think we'll be fine. Is it good y'all are playing so many close games early on? I'm sure y'all want to win more comfortably, ideally, but to be in these moments, be in these situations, are those pretty valuable learning lessons? Yeah, everything's a learning lesson for us. It's a new team, so we just learn how to battle through stuff. We'll figure it out.